We're going to figure out the geometry for H2SE. To do that, we're going to first need the Lewis structure for H2SE. And then we're going to find out the steric number and lone pair surrounding the central atom, which is SE. We have two single bonds and two lone pairs surrounding SE. Keep in mind that single and lone pair each contributes to one steric number. So we have two single bonds, that's two steric number. Two lone pairs, that's two steric number. So two plus two, we have a total of steric number four. As we've already mentioned, SE has two lone pairs. So if we refer to the table on the right hand side, steric number four with two lone pairs is going to give us a bent shape. That's the geometry for H2SE according to the Vesper theory. Here are the two videos that I've handpicked for you. Thanks for watching all the way till the end. If you find this video helpful, be sure to like and share it with someone. Don't forget to subscribe, your support means a lot to me.